Hi, John with eTrailer. Of course, your SUV is full again and you need more space. It's time to check out the Kurt Cargo Carrier. It is a black powder coat finish. This is steel. Inside dimensions, 24 inches by 60 inches. It can hold up to 500 pounds. Now, the weight of this unit alone, keep in mind, is 64 pounds. Now, there's two things I really like about the Kurt. One, the size. It being wide enough that it can fit a cooler sideways like this. The other thing is the expanded steel floor. Um, I prefer this over the basket style. It's kind of an open grid. Um, this still allows, if you have sandy or muddy things, it lets all that f come through. But you, nice, you have a nice flat floor that can actually slide all the way across. Um, the other thing I like is that the Kurt Hitch has a two and a half inch rise on it. So in this instance, if it's mounted on an SUV and you have limited ground clearance back here, this gives you just a little bit more ground clearance. That comes in really handy um, if you're going either off-road or if you're traveling up a steep incline like a driveway grade. So we took this over our test course. It just has a series of speed bumps. Uh, some of them are even, some of them are offset, just to show you the movement of the cargo racks. Personally, does, I don't think it moves all that much, um, but if it does bother you, you could upgrade the pin and clip to an anti-rattle pin and clip, and it'll really secure it down to the hitch. And then that would minimize movement and noise going down the highway. Now a couple things to keep in mind with this Kurt. Um, it doesn't include an anti-rattle pin or clip, so you'll need to purchase one of those. This is also a fixed unit. It doesn't fold up. And at some point, um, if you are loading this, because it's so wide, it's great, uh, but at some point you need to know that you may be blocking your rear camera or possibly your tail lights. And finally, we'll get to some nice features. As far as usability goes, your standard tie-down strap, it does fit around there. Um, and as far as the wall height, usable wall height for us, it's five and a half inches. That's gonna be from the floor to the top of the rail here. So all in all, this is a great product from Kurt for hauling stuff. Um, if it's a little bit too heavy for you, we do have other options here. We have the Flint Hill Goods cargo carrier. This is all aluminum. Um, it comes in light at 16 pounds. Now the dimensions aren't the same. You're not gonna be able to fit the cooler uh, sideways in here, but the inner dimensions on this one are 20 and a half. As far as the length, we're a little over 58 inches. Um, something notable as well, it has an open basket um, bottom on it, but it also is a straight shank. There is no rise to this, but it does come with an anti-rattle pin and clip, and these tighten down securely. Um, they actually thread. It will thread on and cinch down, and it will have little to no movement in your hitch, as opposed to the Kurt here, um, that with a standard pin and clip, it will move a little bit. Now, we do have um, an anti-rattle pin and clip for you here on our website if you want to upgrade uh, your receiver hitch. And that was just a look at some of the cargo rack options that we have available for you here at eTrailer, and that'll finish our look at the Kurt Cargo Carrier.